I'm hustling. Every day I'm hustling. Every day I'm every. What's up, y'all? It's your girl and I for kicks. So today, actually this weekend, is Got Soul. Your girl might just be popping up both days, but definitely today, Saturday. Um, but first, we got to make a pit stop and grab the today's release for hubby. Y'all already know what we got today. We got the reimagined Red Fours. Everybody's getting their W's on sneakers on the actual drop um, or picking up at one of the retail stores that got them we hit at finish line that was insane I think I mentioned it in the last video so we don't need to like recap everything but um, I did put together a little Valentine's inspired fit which I'll show y'all when we get to the event um, I know Valentine's Day is over but it's still the week of and I didn't get to put together a cute little fit so I'm excited I know a lot of you guys whatever you don't care but I'm gonna still show y'all because you're gonna care about what's on foot um, but yeah just a little mall pickup vlog of the reimagined bread fours size we got our pair we're gonna rock them that's what we do all right y'all see it bag secured pair secured now on the way to got soul all right y'all we are here in miami at the convention center for got soul today day one of the got soul weekend um quick little fit check you know just a simple you all know the custom jacket um but we've got the valentine's day eights on today so you know, it's, like I said, it's Valentine's Day week, so I went with the whole Valentine's Day vibe. I'm gonna give my jacket the proper love, though. I can't help it, I gotta show it off. And you know, cute little cute little heart-shaped bag, you guys see it. Um, as far as what I am looking for today, there aren't any like recent releases or upcoming releases that I'm really like looking for to catch my eye. Um, probably gonna be a couple of reachbacks, if anything. But let's be honest, these sneaker events, you never know exactly what you're gonna see. So let's head on inside, see what catches my eye. So we are here at the Yankee Kicks booth here at Got Soul Miami. Of course, you know, you want an unreleased pair. Yankee Kicks is always going to be your go-to. So we have two pairs. Now, I did already show the this pair, the pastoral print, um, at a, an event at the end of last year. But one thing, I, I was just doing my little research, and I noticed that we're getting a lot of like Paris inspired sneakers, which we have the Olympics coming up. That's the host city. We have the City of Love dunk pack they gave us for Valentine's Day. Now these are considered like the City of Style dunks. So it's got a lot of prints that you would see around Paris. So that makes a lot of sense. Um, you know, how many pairs of Paris inspired dunks 
other than the Paris Dunks are we gonna see this year? Now, the pair that I am most excited to see that I literally was talking about walking into this event, if I could see any early pair, this would be it. It is the Big Money Savings Dunk SB. I, personally, to me, like, these are nice, but it's just an all-over print with some edging on it. Like, they're pretty, but these, with the level of detail, the different textures, I mean, get really in there. You've got, like, the Travis Scott SB rope style laces and then to make it even better they did a little tag I think the other one might have the longer version of it but you've got your like your discount tag there you know big money savings and then you've got like um, a cross stitch print on the insole I, I don't know man Nike outdid themselves again with these so let your girl know in the comments below like are you going for one of these and which one if you can only pick one which one are you grabbing? Let your girl know in the comments below. Make sure that you're subscribed to the channel and give your girl a thumbs up for this video. Um, I gotta say, Got Soul Day 1 didn't feel like your typical Got Soul, but it is day one of a two-day weekend Got Soul, and day two is going to have the special guest, Rick Ross. So my theory is that people are saving that money for day two. They want to get everything in all at once. So your girl will be here tomorrow to let y'all know and kind of give you an inside look at what day two looks like but day one was still successful we were able to sell the Jordan 1 mid newspapers we got some profit off of that turn around use the money to buy this pair um, I mean it's in the original box as well it is the diamond turf the diamond turf ones uh, the 2010 release an OG uh, reach back. Y'all know we're big on reach backs over here for hubby. I mean, go ahead, go ahead and tell me this is not a super clean shoe for the age of it and everything. Did a hell of a test on the midsole, making sure that thing's not gonna crumble and it's not going anywhere. So definitely a solid pickup and a very hard pair to find. So again, I think this was a successful day one of Got Soul. Guys, hit that notification bell and tune in for day two. We are back at day two at Got Soul Miami. Um, I mean, already I can tell that it's like a much more downsized version of day one. There's a lot less people here. It is still pretty early. It's about, what, 12.30 right now. We are still waiting on Rick Ross to show up today, so maybe that'll bring in a lot more people, but I don't know, guys. It definitely feels like people are like packing up already and ready to head home, but we're gonna check out the event. We'll be here for a while and we'll see what happens later. October, fall, round fall, but who knows? They also said that they might be canceling it because there's now three pairs coming out this year, so we'll see what happens. All right, guys, keep your eyes open on them, and where can they find y'all at? You can find us at Cold Shoulder Kicks. We're in West Palm Beach, buy, sell, trade, seven days a week. Come through, and we got I, everything. Side note, I absolutely love their shop. Been there, we'll absolutely go back again. So if you're in the area, hit them up. 
But make sure you follow him on Instagram, guys. Oh, yeah. Appreciate, Appreciate it. All right, y'all. So Rick Ross is getting ready to come in the building. So before it gets too crazy, let your girl go ahead and do a little fit check for y'all. I've got a basic Shein t-shirt and cute little off-white bag, some MNML cargos, and of course the Travis Scott thongs. I mean, you know, apparently we're on a whole Travis Scott thing right now. So guys, just keep watching. It's about to get crazy as soon as Rick Ross comes in the building. You know we love this shit anytime it's hustlers and sneakers. It's a motherfucking bomb, but this guy sold shit. Really something special. One time for the homies that put it together. Watching dreams come true for the bosses. Another type of high, you dig? Well, we finna come through. We finna connect. Let's network. Let's take some photos. Show me your flyer shit. Soon as I walk up, Ricky Rose shopping, baby. Boss. Rick Ross, the legend. He wears an 11 and a half, 12, right? Somewhere around there. Okay, cool. Bring the heat out. You know, this is the biggest boss in the game, so show us the heat, what you got, size 11 and a half, 12. We do ask, please, you know, he's a human, we want to hang out, we want to have a good time. We're going to say what's up, but let us walk around and shop around. We appreciate that. Try not to crowd too much. But any, any pictures, whatever we can do, we'll try to do towards the end. So please just let us shop around and enjoy. But we got the best, Rick Ross in the middle. One time for Rick. Come on, make some noise. All right, cool. Let's do it now. Thank you, Miami. Rick Ross in the building. Right. But then it's got to have a pattern to it. Right. 
I know he's not gonna play himself. No. Stop. Rodman, trust me, I had your shit back when I was in school. Your shit was on fire. But I know you got the high tops and low tops. I'm getting the high tops today. I got the lows. I done had the lows maybe two years now, three years. Yeah. You know, time fly. But I love it. Okay. Cool. So that's cool sneaker shit. Yeah. We should we should hashtag sneaker shit. That's what happens. Right. Hundred percent. I'm sure you you get a booth here, nigga on the booth next door. It might be a little plex. You know what I'm saying? Niggas don't hate each other, but it's sneaker shit. You know what I'm saying? Right. Hey, it's competition. We'll get over it. Right. But this is going. This one's your son. Really walking into. He was just shocked. And he's walking around. Me, him, Kyrie. You know the whole crew. Right. right? We're walking around, and Meek sees these, and he sees them, and he asks how much, the guy gives him a price, he starts negotiating, and he says, I'm Meek Mill, you gotta give me the Meek Mill deal, because you never know what the relationship could turn into, whatever it might be. I was fine with that, but people on the internet felt a certain way of, he's Meek Mill, he's a millionaire, he should be paying more. What's your opinion on the Meek Mill viral Jordan 4 situation that got Should he be negotiating, should he be paying the cost? <laughs> <laughs> if you buying the whole rack, there's some kind of love that's If you buying a couple of pair, it's too easy. Right. You know so if it's a big deal, I don't see the big deal. I'ma buy what I want right now. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna buy them right now. What you thinking? Anything on this table you thinking about? I won't. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna hey, go I, with I these. I'm gonna be honest. I those are me. those are a pair. I know I wouldn't have bought, but I just see the passion in her eyes. Uh, yeah, right. No, I see the passion. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. So that that's what it is. So I'm gonna I'm grab these. So three pairs off this off this table alone. Here's some good ones. Grab the New Balances. Hey y'all, so we are wrapping up day two here at Got Soul Miami. Um, nothing too crazy today. Like I said in the beginning, it really was a much more like toned down version of day one. Y'all did see Rick Ross came in the building, you know, he was talking, looking at some shoes, said he was going to come back for a pair, then dipped out. Like, he didn't even look at half of the venue here, which I get it, like, it's a lot going on. He fulfilled his contract or whatever, but now they're, they're talking about they've had special guests in the past send someone in after they leave to make the purchase, so... I don't know, for the table's sake, I'm really hoping somebody's gonna come back in and grab those shoes, make that deal. Um, but your girl almost grabbed a pair today, a pair of the Para Dunks, the abstract Paras. But there was a little discrepancy there. I was told 250, then all of a sudden it was 280, and I'm like, you know, I don't want them bad enough to deal with that back and forth. It's just kind of a chill vibe today. Um, I'm about to head home. It is pouring. I am starving. I hope you guys enjoyed the two-day Got Soul event video. And hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell because we got plenty of stuff like this coming up, guys. And as always, keep tuning in to see what I got my eye on next.